clients are no longer confined to the office, and nor are their clients. They're mobile. They need fast access to authoritative and well-researched information, along with the content, the tools, the community, and the support to be able to go out there and to practice efficiently. They also need to be able to interact with the information, how they want to, and when they want to, to run a truly efficient practice. Now, CGT for securities is one of the more complex areas, and when you're dealing with that, you need historical dividend information, a detailed understanding of the various corporate actions, and share price data for every listed company and trust in Australia, back to the birth of CGT in 1985. You need tax data on over 10,000 securities. I'm going to show of hands of everybody in the room that has actually used Google or Yahoo Finance or other free websites to do their CGT research. Okay, so there's a fair few hands getting stuff, back, stuff into the air right now. And look, Google and Yahoo Finance and all of these websites are great. I mean, they're free, right? The problem with them is the amount of time that you're spending actually researching all of the CGT related data. It's the time that you're spending with the data entry, okay, with the calculation, with the reporting. It's then the time that it's taken up from the partners and the senior accountants who have to go through and check all of that information to verify that it's actually correct. So the truth is, it comes at a huge cost to your practice. It costs you efficiency and it limits your effectiveness. Then you have to ask yourself, what happens if this data that you're finding on all of these free websites is actually incorrect? What if you have an issue with, say, the data entry, you've keyed in some of the numbers incorrectly? And is that information actually something that you can rely on to actually make critical business decisions? Now, accountants also need information on entities that have failed, merged, delisted, changed names, been suspended, and entities that have just vanished. Entities that no longer have websites or share registries that can help us. Okay? Now, you might have to then deal with something like rollover relief one day, when you have a need to go back through many, many years of data. Okay? Now, I think you'd agree that it's slightly harder to get your hands on that information. My responsibility as a product manager is to go out there and to engage customers, and also non-customers. Okay? And the feedback that I overwhelmingly hear is that there are certain scenarios when it's just impossible to get your hands on the right information. Beyond having access to the right information, you need to be able to drill down into relevant information like this ATO class ruling that you see here. And you also need access to some of the more obscure source documents so that you can fully understand and, and gain some further insight into complicated tax matters so that you know how to treat them for your clients. These are the sort of resources that you need to provide that level of service that your clients deserve. And to provide that level of service that you actually demand of yourselves as accountants. Now accountants also need a solution that will allow them to jump back through years of tax data. There's something that you can use to recreate a shareholding over time. Say, for example, that you have a client who inherits a portfolio of shares that include pre-CGT assets. Okay? The first thing they do is they rush off to their stockbroker and they sell the entire lot so they can take the money and invest it into some, into some property. Okay? Then you need a solution that will allow you to recreate that shareholding all the way back to 1985. Something that will factor in all those additional shares that have been amassed from dividend reinvestment plans. Something that will consider all of the cash issues, all the different corporate actions, and all the different elements that have perhaps restructured the portfolio over time. The truth actually is that accountants have better ways to manage their time than to be Googling all sorts of information. Now, if you use new technology correctly, time is exactly what your practice has to gain. Now, I'm sure that you can do better things with your time than to actually allocate it to unbillable activities that, in the end, ultimately, aren't something that you can rely upon to make critical business decisions. And many accounts then push it back on their clients to go hunting for all of this additional information that they need to get their hands on to. Okay? And when this happens, usually the information will come through the door in drips and drabs. But each time that you open up that folder without completing the workflow, you've just spent even more time that you didn't need to spend. And when you push it back on your clients to go and do all of the running around to try to find all of this information, you've got to ask yourself, is this really the best level of service that I can provide my clients? 
Now, working with CCH is solutions. You don't have to do this, and you don't have to let it slow you down either. Furthermore, you need to have solutions at your practice that you can try risk-free. Solutions that are cost-effective to implement, and also solutions that are easy to use. They also need to inherently connect to important areas of your practice that are already well established, so that you can ensure that you are running a truly efficient practice that can focus on billable hours and focus on increasing the efficiencies. You need these solutions to allow you to choose the ways that you want to interact with them. Not only that, but the ways that your staff want to interact with them. And importantly, the ways that your clients want to interact with them. They need to be inherently connected to your practice. But not only the way that it operates right now, but it needs to be connected to your workflow and your activities as they grow over time, as they develop. Okay? And you need to focus on anything you can to obviously run a more efficient practice. 